हेलो एवरीवन आई एम सौरस पांडे दिस इज इक्वल डिपॉजिटरी एंड यू आर वाचिंग मॉड्यूल नंबर सिक्स ऑफ पोस्ट केस एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव एडेड द पोस्ट केस यूजर इनटू द सुडोर्स ग्रुप एंड देन वी हैव सीन द बैकग्राउंड प्रोसेसेस ऑफ आवर पोस्ट केस इंस्टेंस एंड वी वर ऑल्सो एबल टू सी दैट पोस्ट मास्टर प्रोसेस वॉज एबल टू स्टार्ट द किल्ड ऑटो वैक्यूम लॉन्चर प्रोसेस नाउ इन दिस वीडियो वी विल रिस्टोर अ सैम्पल डेटा बेज नेम्ड डी रेंटल For this, I will first connect to my Postgres instance. So I will type p SQL. Then I will create that DVD rental database. Right now, I don't have any database with this name. So I will go ahead and write create database. Oops. Ah, uh, okay. Create database DVD rental. Now that database has been created. So I will quit from the Postgres instance, and then I will download the file. and in order to download the file i guess i have already downloaded the file but let me actually go ahead and uh, delete all the files inside uh, in the home directory of postgres so for this i will write rm home postgres and delete everything inside this hit enter yes it is done now if i list directory okay i can still see uh, those command because it is write protected so what i'll do i'll have to provide the sudo permission and this time it is done and if i list directory this time it is not showing me any content because everything has been deleted so now to download the file i would write sudo space curl space hyphen capital o and then i will have to provide the url from where i want to download the file so i have kept the url here i will just copy this url paste it here i will give everything in the description so you don't have to type anything and now the the database file has been downloaded so if i list directory now the file is inside the directory but now i will have to unzip that file and to unzip that file first i will install unzip on my uh, virtual machine so for this i will write sudo apt install unzip it is already installed in my machine so it says the uh, unzip is uh, already uh, with the newest version is already installed but if it is not installed in your virtual machine then it will go ahead and install the unzip once the unzip is installed what you will have to do is you will have to type sudo then unzip and then the path of the file which is home postgres however you are inside the same path so if you will not give the complete path then also it will work but let me give the complete path and then the file name and hit enter now this time if you list the directory you can see an another file which is dvd rental dot tar so we have unzipped the file now using this file we will restore the database and for this we will use an another utility which is pc underscore restore and then the db name it is dvd rental and we have already created the empty database and then verbose just for the information and then the file location which is home postgres dvd rental dot tar and if i hit enter it will restore uh, the database for me so if i'll connect to my p sql instance again and then i'll list the database i have the dvd and dvd rental database i have created the empty database but i will see if there is there are objects inside this database or not so for this i will go to dvd rental database so for this i will type backslash c dvd rental hit enter now i am connected to dvd rental database so i will list out all the tables so for this i will type the command backslash dt hit enter you can see there are lots of tables and just to verify i will check if there is any row inside those tables so i will write select star from actor limit 1 
hit enter and yes there is content inside this so we have successfully restored the database uh, the sample database named dvd rental but if you have the file using the same process you can restore any any the any of the database right so this is what i wanted to cover in this video in the next video i will discuss the configuration files of postgres and then after that in the next video i will discuss the basic commands of postgres so i will see you again in the next video thank you for watching this video